Hello team and welcome to today's video in Google Sheets where I'm going to be showing you how to create a dynamic search box so that if you enter in a value, in this case a name, your data is filtered based on your input. And we'll look at how to set this up for one or multiple columns within your data set. Let's jump in. Starting with cell A6 below our column headers, we're going to begin by entering in the filter function. The range of our filter function will be our entire original list, so I'll click and highlight over those first and last names. After a comma, we'll enter in the isNumber function for partial matches, followed by the search function. Within the search function, where we'll be searching for is cell B2, which is our search box. After a comma, our search range will start off with the first name column, so I'll click and highlight that entire column. Three closing parentheses to wrap up this function, and click enter. You'll see since our search box is blank, all the first and last names appear within our filtered section. But if I enter in the name Carrie, you'll see my list is filtered based on my input. And this works even if I put a partial match. However, if I enter in one of the last names, you'll see we get no result. So next, let's take a look at how to add additional columns to our search box. To add the last name column as well to our search box, we need to first enter an opening parentheses in front of the original isNumber function. I'll then use the Alt plus Enter key to create some space on the next line. We'll use the plus symbol to add an AND to this function. Open parentheses, and same as before, we're going to enter isNumber and then search. The search box will be the same as before, cell B2. After a comma, this time though, we're searching in the last name column, so I'll click and highlight that entire column. After four closing parentheses to wrap up this function, click enter. And now you'll see if in the search box, I type out Smith, which is a last name, I get my correct results. Team, I hope you enjoyed these tips today. Please like and subscribe to the channel for future videos and leave comments about additional tips you'd like to see covered.